Hello everyone, it's been a very long time since I've uh, made a video, since I've even been out. Um, life has just thrown me all sorts of curveballs lately, so super, super excited to be out this weekend. I've brought both of my dogs. You guys see Charlie all the time, but I don't bring Ellie too often. Um, she doesn't like being off-road. She's super awkward when it's really... Um, when it's really bumpy and off camber and she's just not, I guess, super sure of her, her footing. So I don't take her out too often, but um, over the winter she had cancer. We got that taken care of. Unfortunately, she has a different type of cancer now. Um, and I just, I couldn't, as anxious as she is in the truck, she's so happy when she's out at camp. So I couldn't leave her behind anymore. Um, hopefully we'll get this cancer taken care of and, and that'll be that. I don't expect that uh, that she'll be leaving us anytime soon, but I'm not gonna uh, I'm not gonna short her, you know, the, the pleasure of being outside because she really does love it. So I want to explore a little bit. I'm in an area that I've been to often. I've been to this exact spot in a video previously with my brother. Um, and it's a super cool spot just on the other side of the hill uh, you can probably hear it but the rivers running past us we are just covered in the most beautiful greenery and trees and just it's this is a gorgeous spot um, but I do want to explore the area a little bit more so I think the pups and I are gonna pack up here after a little bit after they are done stretching their legs and and go see what we can get into Get up there, oh, you got it. <laughs> All right, I got you, I got you. Good girl. There are quite a few perks to having a trailer. But one of the top reasons that I love having the trailer is this exact situation. I have camp claimed and I want to go see what else is around this area. So I'm leaving my trailer there. No one can steal my spot now. It's secure. And uh, now I'm just gonna go explore a little bit. It's one of the best things ever about having a trailer. Unfortunately, our exploring just led us to gate closure after gate closure. While there were good views along the way, we decided to head back to camp, play some fetch, and get some dinner going. On the menu tonight, beer brats. Recently, this has been one of my absolute favorite go-to camping meals.
Well, hello. Another plus with taking the trailer out is the ability to easily clean all the dishes, which reduces the amount of cleanup that I have once I get back home. Okay, little update, um, a large branch uh, fell uncomfortably close to um, the trailer. So we're gonna pack up and find another spot. so we have found camp um, no trees to fall on us here and to be honest this spots way better um, I love being by water but this view is insane and this was actually plan a um, today but when I was here before all these spots were taken um, so which is why I ended up at the river so <clears throat> Super glad to be here. The sunset's gonna be insane. Very much looking forward to that.
Wildland coffee is an essential part of my morning because it's super simple and it's delicious. Literally bring eight to 12 ounces of water, you know, depending on how dark you like your coffee to a near boil, pour it over the tea bag and let it steep for five minutes. No messing with the French press or cleanup. Just as simple as that. It is also very effective. How effective? My third sip. After an amazing cup of coffee, we had some breakfast, got packed up, and headed out pretty early so we could get a hike in before the heat and the crowds rolled in. Hello, Charlie. Oh, Eleanor. Hello, Ellie. Can some space, please? Hiking is something that I don't do a lot of when I'm out, but it's something that I always want to do. The hike we chose was not one that was marked. I happened to hear rushing water while driving by it, and that was what drew us in. This was a fantastic weekend out with my pups. I met quite a few people while out there, explored some new areas, and thoroughly enjoyed my time in the woods and watching my dogs enjoy it as well. I'm hoping that these trips are going to become more frequent. But until next time, I hope you're able to get off the grid and off the grind, and I'll see you in the next one.